Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back. I'm Melanie Kate Love and thank you so much for joining me here for another episode. Oh my gosh, my loves, we are so close to hitting 1 million views on my YouTube channel and that is so exciting because that means that our beautiful MK Love fam is growing and that you're watching my beautiful content and you are sharing it with anyone that needs to hear this message and that, my loves, is a truly beautiful thing. Now today I wanted to talk to you about balance. What? I know, you're probably like, dude, I know what balance is. Yeah, but do you actually apply it into your life? Because that's a completely different story. Now, recently I have noticed with the energies associated with whatever's going on astrologically, I have just had this more childlike sense of wonder and I need, I need to play a lot more. So I actually, um, have been spending time like going to the beach, going for a walk and literally like finishing work for, at like two or three and be like, okay, hey, stop. It's my self-love time. I need to go out, I need to recalibrate, recharge my batteries so I can vibrate again on the frequency of love. Because sometimes we become so fixated and we're like, this is the goal. This is what I need to do. Like for me for so long, actually, let me give you a really good example of this <gasps> that ended really badly. About, I'd say about a, just over a year ago, I, no, probably a year and a half ago, I was actually enrolled in this entrepreneurial program where they were actually paying me to write, um, to basically fund my business. And what happened was that I put so much stress within myself to write a, um, a basically a recipe ebook. It was like everything you need that's gonna help you on your transition to become vegan and to eat a whole food plant-based diet that was like ridiculously simple and easy and it was minimal ingredients because I'm like the laziest cook in the whole wide world. Anyway, so what I did was I was getting so uptight about it. It literally, to the point where I manifested a urinary tract infection in my body, which Fast forward, let me just tell you the end of the story. I was in hospital for like two or three days. It was, it got to that point where I literally couldn't walk. I had no energy. And I just wanted to bring that story up for you because I wasn't spending enough time being balanced. I was like, this is the goal. Someone is paying me. I have to do a good job. But instead, if I was to step back and was like, okay, I've done my very, very best today. It's now time for me to go out and to live a life because a life where you are literally just, you know, I really don't like the term hustle. You hear so many entrepreneurs going, I'm gonna hustle, 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 hustle harder. I was like, that sounds like the most ridiculous thing in the whole wide world to me. Why don't you just allow things to just come forth? Um, and plus the universe works on divine time anyway. Anyway, so I was like hustling hard to the point where I got really sick. And if I look back at that, I wasn't happy. I wasn't happy at all. And now I look at how I have been able to create a website within a month, which will be released very, very shortly. And that has been a goal for mine for like two years. And I bought so many different website themes and long story short, I have the website that I have always wanted and I created that by having balance and spending time on just me and having my self-love days for me because that makes me feel truly good, you know, just like going to the beach. It could be something as simple as like, okay, you finish work at whatever time and however many hours or maybe you only have 10 minutes if you have kids, whatever it works best for you, spend time literally just being like, this is my self-love time. Well, you can just stop. Even if it's like you have like 10 minutes and you're driving somewhere, you put on your favorite song and you sing to the top of your lungs to your favorite song, that's gonna raise your vibration. And when you start raising your vibration, doing things that you truly love, that's when you like you have the balance and you have like the the stamina and you also have like the uh, it's like you everything just becomes easier it just stops the stress levels and that's when you're able to find balance in whatever you're doing and you know you'll be able to get things done a lot quicker if you take yourself away from that another reason I can say that now is because when I used to be a primary school teacher, I was working from, 
I'd be at school at 7 and I would leave school at 7 p.m. So I was working 12 hour days, Monday to Friday, right? Saturday, I didn't really work. That was kind of like my day off. And then I would work half a day on Sunday from like the after, like lunchtime to till I went to bed, planning for the next week. That unbalanced life that I lived was so detrimental to my health. Number one, I put on a crap ton of weight. Um, I had friends, beautiful friends actually, um, my houses if you're watching, hey, <laughs> and um, you know, but I just, I wasn't, I wasn't living, I was just working for someone else making them rich and that really didn't sit well for me, me being an Aries fire sign born leader, I didn't like that and I quit that job. And my parents and my friends and family were like, you're crazy, it's good money, blah, blah, blah. It's like, nah, money doesn't make you happy. I'd rather have a balanced life where I had less and lived more. Because you know, the most beautiful thing in the whole wide world is time, you know? And trading your time for money, that doesn't work well for me. And, you know, I just think that finding balance in whatever you are doing is a truly beautiful thing. Maybe it means that you get up an extra hour early and you have the most beautiful bath with essential oils and Epsom salts and, oh, I wish I had a bath here. That would be amazing. And, or maybe you take yourself to a spa or maybe you go to the gym, but you don't go to the gym and you just use their facilities and like their steam room and the sauna and whatever else they have going on there. Just. Find the balance in your life. That is my message for today. Find what truly be works best for you so that you have time to let your inner child play and for you to raise your vibration so you close the gap of resistance, you get rid of all that crappy stress that just manifests illness and disease within your body and you manifest the most beautiful life that you never thought was possible. But literally, my love, you have the power to live a balanced life. You just have to find time. You, you have to not find time. You have to make the time to get there. Anyways, my love, I hope that it's made sense today. I just wanted to bring that up because it's something that has been like coming up quite a lot in my subconscious recently. And it's obviously a message that my angels want me to share with you. So I just want to say thank you so much for watching. If you love this video, there's a couple of things I need you to do. Number one, like this video because that totally helps support this channel. Number two is to comment and let me know what are you doing to live a more balanced life. And three, subscribe to this beautiful family because that would be amazing. And if you could share this content so we could crack 1 million views on this channel, that would be amazing. Anyways, my love, have an amazing day wherever you are in the world. Remember, when you vibrate in the frequency of love, you manifest your heart's true desires and you live a beautiful, balanced life. Bye, my loves. Bye.